24-7 TV. Brent Renaud is an American film director and winner of the Peabody and DuPont Awards. The Renauds lead a Peabody Award-winning team producing for HBO, NBC, Discovery, PBS, The Night Times, and Vice News. Founders of Little Rock Rock Film Festival, The Profile says. Brent Renaud is a Peabody and DuPont Award-winning filmmaker and has spent the past two decades producing films and television programs with his brother Craig. According to IMDb, the Renaud brothers are best known for telling humanistic stories from the world's hot spots, and their projects have covered the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan, the earthquake in Haiti, political turmoil in Egypt and Libya, the fight for Mosul, extremism in Africa, cartel violence in Mexico, and the youth refugee crisis in Central America. Their work, a Edward Dar Murrow Award, an Ida Award, a DGA nomination for Best Directors, and multiple Emmy nominations. Their films have also received critical acclaim in Entertainment Weekly, Rolling Stone, Forbes, USA Today, The New York Times, Filmmaker Magazine, The Los Angeles Times, and American Cinematographer. Craig and his brother Brent also founded the Little Rock Film Festival and the Arkansas Motion Picture Institute. How Brent Renault died on March 13, 2022, Advisor to the Minister of Internal Affairs of Ukraine Ant Onjerashchenko announced that Brent Renaud died in Ukraine in Irpin, Kyiv region. According to Jerashchenko, the cause of death was shelling by the Russian occupiers. The invaders cynically kill even international media journalists who are trying to show the truth about the atrocities of Russian troops in Ukraine. Today, according to Jerashchenko, another journalist was wounded. They are trying to get him out of the war zone. Later, Jerishchenko showed a video with him. Of course, the profession of a journalist involves risk. However, a citizen Brent Renaud paid with his life for trying to highlight the treachery, cruelty, and ruthlessness of the aggressor, Jerishchenko wrote. At the same time, he showed Brent Renaud's ID, which indicated the publication of the New York Times. In turn, the head of the Kyiv region police Andrew Nebatov showed a video with policeman Alexander Bugay from the scene of the execution of international journalists in Irpin. In addition to the deceased 51-year-old Brent, two more correspondents were injured. Now the wounded, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, subscribe my channel. It's Mike from 24 TV.